Like, bro, I reacted to this song. Damn, that shit got almost 600k in a day. It's crazy. But I reacted to that, bro, and everybody spamming me about this Mo Cardi song. This, you feel me? Y'all see the title, bro. I, I don't need to. You feel me? Like, I, I don't even want to talk about it. But official audio, this shit crazy, bro. But. 18,000? I wasn't even gonna write this because the audio, that's what I was saying. 18,000 on the audio is crazy, bro. <laughs> nah, it's a crazy cover. Now, Mo Cardi, I don't know where he's been, bro, but he's one of them forgot about 4 1 members. I, I, I be forgetting about him when I talk about like the Bills, my cancel the people that are not on top of 4 1. But he's definitely up there. I think he got a song or two with like Coward or something like that. <laughs> I ain't gonna lie, bro. He he don't got like the list, like nasty, like like he don't got the congestion. Like that's what it is. Like he he sound like he got congested, but he sound like nasty low key. Is how's it? And I seen all the hypocrisy that people were saying, like, oh, you feel me? There's a 13 year old boy that died, and people were making fun of him, shit like that. Bro, for me, bro, if you dissing anybody, like, that's not around your age range, that's a kid, bro. 13, 14 is a kid. I don't give a fuck what people say, bro. Like, I think I think it's, like, crazy for anybody to diss a 13, 14-year-old. But for someone that's not Nate Burrow to diss, you feel me, Naughty, that's what makes it weird for me, bro. You had no prior relationship to him. The people that diss the 13-year-old, J-Rip, bro, they, they, their blocks were beefing. You feel me? That's why they were dissing each other, because they would have, they had beef. Like, you feel me? If one of them died, they would be smoking on them. So it makes sense, bro. And you feel me? I don't, I don't think anybody should dish. I don't, the energy you put out there is energy going to get back. I say that all the time. But 4 is different because this was on some rap shit. You feel me? He just said it was on no rap shit. He said 4-1-K. Y'all saying 4 ones a rap collective, rap group, whatever it is, bro. I, I'm not going to read in between the lines, bro. I'm just going to say how it is, bro. If it's, if it's a rap group, like, bro, y'all saying it's a rap group. So when they say 41k, y'all take so much offense to that that y'all dropped a whole song dedicated to him. You feel me? This is the second one dedicated to him. This title, look at the title, and it's like, bro, he wasn't even in your borough, bro. And that's like, bro, I see that all the time, bro. People keep saying like, oh, yo, on four ones ass because they doing this, they doing that, bro. The only reason I got a problem with it is because that he's a 14 year old boy. First off, I don't think anybody should be dissing anybody that's not around the age range. They're 19, 20. 18 whatever bro that they're, they're grown enough to understand that he's a 14 year old boy at the end of the day and he passed away to something that had nothing to do with do with their guys or anything they didn't have beef until after he passed away and they seen the snippet that snippet was out and no one said anything no one before one had a problem with it because they didn't know who nadi osama was until he passed away and then they seen it and then they're like oh yeah they he's saying he jacking my k he j uh, putting a k to my shit so i'm gonna smoke on him like, that's some rap shit, bro. That's why Drew just, like, is so watered down and corny now, bro. Like, motherfuckers smoking on 14 year olds that they have never met in real life, never had a problem with until after they passed away and, and maybe found a snippet of him saying 41K. Granted, you feel me? The energy put out is the energy gonna get back. You feel me? If someone would have passed away on 41 side, you feel me? They would have smoked on him. You feel me? It is what it is. But I'm just saying for all of 41 to diss something like that. And them not to know him personally at all. Didn't even know his name probably before he passed away. It's just crazy, bro. But. And it's just like, bro. Like, why, why would 4-1 and them be so, like. People saying they so thirst, so thirsty for the ops. Whatever they want ops so bad. It's just like, bro. You didn't even need to drop that shit for people to know. Your worth and your potential, bro. People know how good you are, bro. You didn't need to do that shit. So it's just like, why? 
Why do it? Bro? Why we losing my block? They're 41. Hey, they got that shit checking like number seven right now as I'm recording a video or something. Get this shit deeper than no rap. Nigga be lying, we shoot at his cop. We ain't 41 kid, nigga, stop him. And they checking out 41 bopping. Now it's just time that they see that he bopping. Right here, though. Clutching the knife. After dropping your head to your chest. Keep poking. Keep poking. Now that you learn, you gon' do it your lap. That's right. Smoking on. Nah, he talking. Now it's just time that they see that bro, I seen a motherfucker on the Warriors doing that shit, bro. This shit really crazy. This shit really going viral for them, bro. I really hope they they move tactical though. All for everybody for one, bro. Cause the second something happens to somebody, bro, it's it's gonna be crazy, bro. I, I'm praying for both sides. Hopefully they can stay out of each other's way and get money, bro. Cause they're both winning at the end of the day. Didi Osama's going crazy. Kyle Rich is going crazy. Everyone for four one. Oh, wise. They got new found a light in, in Sugar Hill. They, they they found like a new something, bro. They 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 they, they, they going crazy, bro. They all going crazy musically speaking. I just hope they stay out the way, bro. Bobby, right here, though. Cussing the knife. After dropping your head to your chest. Keep poking, keep poking. Now that you learn, you gonna do it your life. That's right. Nah. Smoking on naughty. It's really a dance anthem, bro. He really like. When I shoot, I be losing control. Like you know, Jenny be ready to throw. Uh, Move time like an immigrant. Gotta get low. She has that with the dick on her I have a question because I've seen everybody say this shit. Shy K, E dot, D D. Bro, if you see a, somebody that's like, I mean, they from Harlem or whatever, bro. And what if they go to like, go to, go to Manhattan, just for example. I'm not saying anything, but I know there's oppositions everywhere. But they just drive by it. They see someone outside making a TikTok. Or they go they go to Times Square, bro. And they just see everybody doing a, doing the, you feel me, the bop. What, what is Sugar Hill supposed to do? Like, are they going to, like, press them or some shit? Like, stop doing that, bro. Like, you feel me? Like, I don't know, bro. Because I seen Shy K, like, oh, if I see anybody naughty bopping, it's up with them. They get, uh, uh, uh. I'm like, bro. Like if if some random civilian is doing it, bro, what can you do for real? Like I, I think I think it's in Sugar Hill's best exam, best um, what's it called? Best interest. It's in Sugar Hill's best interest to try to make a song. And I know they got a song about four ones, one of they dead mans. I don't even know if it's they dead mans or whatever. Um, coming. I know Blockwood said he was gonna make a song about it or something like that. But I think it's in their best interest to keep this rap in, in rap like in a rap aspect of. Hey, Sugar Hill need to make a viral song that, you feel me, is poking fun at the dead. You feel me? I don't, I don't think they should do that, but I'd rather them do that than go out and start pressing surveillance or spinning on the ops and doing some real life shit that don't need to be involved, bro. Because just keep this right, bro. Keep it in songs and shit like that because you can't really get mad at civilians doing a dance, bro. You feel me? They, they, they probably don't know the politics behind them. Like you know Jenny be ready to throw. Move time like an immigrant. Gotta get low. She has that with the dick on her throat. Like a vehicle, driving a boat. She has that, she has set up. I'm blowing one life for a bitch with this gun that I throw. I'm niggas funny. Niggas be broke. Like bitch, ain't no joke. He's gonna operate that by a boat. Now you see why I'm pulling up Joe. You can not run, you get head in the throat. Yeah, these operators get in the smoke. The way that I spin, they gon' think I'm a foe. Lord, I'm rushing, I close the low. I got a gun that I keep in my right. And that shit when they get me tight. If we ditch it, get sent to the light. I spot him, I got a can hop from the pipe. But these bitches, they stay in the night. Bitch, I'm a thot, I don't want me a wife. That's how I'll be gon' shoot him on sight. Everything day, he gon' bet for his life. I'm in this spot, for one poppin'. Cause I always get hit and it's topping. Like, bitch, let's get it poppin'. That nigga down, I was smoking on Naughty Pop. Naughty Pop, Naughty Pop, Naughty Pop, Naughty Pop, Naughty Pop, Naughty Pop, Naughty Pop. Damn, he say he's spinning my block, okay? Too deep, let's go away. Spinning up best, like I'm Nate. Big gun, shoot like Clay. It's crazy, bro. Bro, yeah, no hating shit, bro. It's a good song, bro. But just crazy, bro. That everybody, this is crazy, bro. He getting this off of off of one early song, bar, bro. Bro, if I was Didi Osama, bro, I would just release a Nadi Osama song where, you feel me, he did he did for one at this point, bro. Because they getting a whole bunch of clout off this shit, bro. They going crazy, bro. Like, I can't. 
600k in a day, bro. Like, what the fuck? That's really crazy, bro. They got my NBA players singing this shit or doing a little dance in game. Like, what the fuck? Like, going viral, bro.